Woo. What's going on you guys? Welcome to the Single Guy channel. My name is Lloyd. Today we're gonna be talking about how to introduce yourself to a woman that you like. Basically, most guys, when they introduce themselves, they usually do it wrong, okay? Like, they usually come in with too high energy, too low energy. They don't convey the confidence that women are looking for in an attractive man. Um, and, and so, right off the bat, the woman automatically discounts him as, like, an available suitor. She puts him in the friend, another dude, uh, that kind of category. And she doesn't see him as a man. So, in this video, what I'm going to be talking about is I'm going to be talking about the, the things that guys usually get wrong. Um, uh, when they introduce themselves so how to introduce yourself like a man that's going to be the second part of it okay how to do this right uh, and then the final thing that i'm going to be teaching you guys is how to introduce other people the right way too to convey that confidence um because women are definitely paying attention to how you introduce other people you know they show you how you behave they they want to see how you behave towards others because that's a good indication about how you're going to behave towards them Okay, cool. So before I get into this, you guys, if you're wondering how to do this, um, I have an eight-week program coming out that's going to be more affordable than my weekly one-on-one -on -one coaching program. So if you think you're going to be a good fit, put send me an email with the words team in it. I, I can only take about a couple more guys in this. Um, so if you want to get in that, I would recommend you email me very soon. Okay, cool. So let's talk about the first few things that guys get wrong. Now, typically when guys come in, they introduce themselves to a woman that they like, they either come in too low energy, hey, how's it going, I'm Lloyd, or they come in with too high, hey, what's up girl, how's it going? Hey, you know, like that's a little too much too. Now, it depends on the context too. If you're going in to introduce yourself to a woman, you kinda wanna be somewhere in the middle but you wanna be at a similar energy level that they are, and I would pick slightly higher, okay? Because you wanna raise the energy up typically. Now, if they're running around like, woo, having a good time, like, okay, maybe, maybe we don't wanna up it too much. Um, but if you come, if some girls are like dancing around and they're like high energy and you come in just, hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd. Well, you're, you're killing the vibe. You're killing the party. So they're probably not going to want to talk to you as much. Okay. So make sure you come in at their level, maybe a little bit higher, but if the energy is way too high, maybe, uh, maybe not so high for that, but you want to come in at a similar energy level. The other thing that guys do too, is they hesitate when they come in. Like I see this all the time. You, if you, especially in a, in an environment like uh, like a high volume churn party environment, like a bar, or a club, or social event, or something like that, if you come in with two, like you just start hesitating, the girl's just literally just gonna turn to the to the to her friend and then walk away. Like that's what happens like 90% of the time. If you come in, uh, hey, how's it going? Okay, she's already left. Um, so what you want to do is you want to come in kind of like, hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd. Nice to meet you. How's your night been? So. Basically, you want to come in with a, some authority, some um, a little. I would say relaxed authority, meaning that you're coming in firm, um, but you're not being like overbearing or aggressive. So you kind of want to find that mixed in between. And I'm going to talk about how to find that. Okay. Um, the other thing that a lot of guys do too is they come in and they end things with like an upward inflection. So they'll be like, "Hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd." Ending up, "Hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd." That's what you want to do. You want to come in when the, with the tone being like, you, you don't want to end up. Anytime you end up, that's permission seeking and she's going to throw you into the friend, um, you know, boy, you know, an, just another guy category, not a man. And the other thing that a lot of guys do too is finally, it, maybe they might talk with good tonality, maybe they might come in with the right energy, but they don't come in very personably. Like they make the person feel like they don't care about them. They'll just, they won't give them eye contact. They'll kind of look to the side. You want to make that person feel important. Anytime you make a person feel important, they're going to really like you. Remember that. It's a huge motivational factor for why people do things. So the right way to come in when you're introducing yourself is to come in, make it personal, dude. Like sometimes I like to Depending on if I'm coming in with a handshake or a hug, I typically like to do hugs, especially if it's, you know, I'm, I'm living here in Latin America and a lot of pe more people do the hugs here um, or in, you know, really in any part of the world. Um, but if it's a more formal setting, I might do do a handshake or something like that. So let's say it's a handshake. So I'll come in with the handshake and I'll like say, hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd. Nice to meet you. I'll give good eye contact. I'll make sure the handshake is firm, not as firm as it would be for a man's or not as firm as it would like. It wouldn't be the same as like a business meeting handshake. I try and show a little bit more affection. I try and make it more uh, charismatic when I'm talking to a woman that I like at a party or something like that. I'll be like, hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd. Nice to meet you. How you doing? 
you know? I'll make it a little softer than that, um, show a little bit more affection. Because business meetings um, and social events are slightly different. Okay, um, if it's a hug, what I'll do is I'll make sure that I'll hold her, like I'll be, you know, I'll show that I have strength, um, but I'm not gonna hurt her. So like, I want her to feel when she gives me a hug or she shakes my hand, that I'm very capable of holding her and keeping her safe, okay? You, you want it to feel warm, relaxed, and secure when a woman's shaking hands with you because that's the man that she's looking for. Like, a, a lot of times when a woman meets you, she's deciding, can this guy protect me? Does this guy have the confidence to do so? And if you demonstrate with a handshake or a hug, that's a great way to do it, okay? So remember, good eye contact, safe and secure, um, uh, and you're coming in with assertiveness, but not aggressiveness. One thing that really helps this, you guys, is I would recommend that you hold it for, hold the eye contact, hold the smile for just a little bit longer. Speak slower. Too many guys, when they come in, I find that they're like, hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd. Doesn't sound secure. Hey, how's it going? I'm Lloyd. Speak a little bit slower. Don't try and rush through things and take your time with each individual person. If you show that you've taken the time to meet them, they're probably gonna like you a lot more. Now, when it comes to introducing other people, let's talk about that. Um, you don't wanna do a lot of the stuff that I said before, again. So if I'm introducing my buddy over here, I'm not gonna be like, or this could honestly be somebody that I just met. I'd meet a lot of people when I'm out too. If I'm just like, hey, here's my buddy, or I completely ignore him, I don't even introduce him, what's that gonna tell her? It tells her that I don't really care about the friends around me, I don't really take the time to introduce them to other people. If she becomes one of those people, she's gonna be standing next to me and I'm gonna be ignoring her as well. But if I take the time to introduce my buddy, hey, here's my buddy Max, he's an awesome dude, like he has this in common with you, blah, 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 blah. Like I've obviously taken the time to show her like that I like my friends, that I'm leading them to introduce them to other people, so I'm a guy of, you know, I'm, I'm not some pushover. Um, and I also care about the people around me, dude. And if you're a person in my life, I'm gonna care a lot about you as well. That gives her a lot of great information that makes her want to get to know you more, that makes her want to like you, go home with you, date you, do whatever, okay? So introducing your uh, other people is an extremely important thing, something I do a lot when I'm out, okay, too. Now, I know a lot of you guys are watching this and thinking, hey Lloyd, it's great that you're teaching me how to introduce myself with confidence, but at the end of the day, I'm not a very confident person. How do I introduce myself with more confidence? Well, one of the biggest tips that I can give you for this is to master the conversation after introducing yourself. If I introduce myself to someone, I've done this thousands of times, man, like however poorly it goes, maybe our hands slip, maybe the hug gets a little weird and we bang cheeks. <laughs> I've done this so many times that I can handle the conversation afterwards. I can make a joke of it, um, or and then I can lead straight into getting to know them. Hey, how's it going? My name's Lloyd, nice to meet you. How's your night been? Oh, great, awesome. Yeah, we were just at that bar over there. Where are you from, are you from the area? You know, I can lead into it very easily, get to know them, so I have ultimate confidence when I walk up. And if you're wondering how to master this conversational framework at the end, I suggest you watch my five questions I ask every single girl when I'm out. Also, I'd, rec I'd recommend that you check out my How to Talk to Girls playlist. And finally, dude, like, check out my new program that I'm coming out with. We're gonna spend a bunch of modules covering the start to the finish, once you, uh, even before you leave the house, introducing yourself, having that man to woman connection, keeping her interested and leading it into a direction where you're actually gonna make some progress with this girl, okay? All that stuff is gonna be covered. All right, guys, so that's how you introduce yourself to a woman that you like. Remember, don't come in with too little like confidence. Don't be hesitating. Don't be, go, come in with a 100%. If you, if you come in with 98 or 99% authority, it's still a failure, okay? Come in with 100%. Thanks a lot, you guys. Good luck out there.